In the previous tutorial, I explained how to work with the Roof tool in ARCHICAD. In this tutorial, I would like to draw a wall that ends exactly to the roof that has a slope. We can do this trick by using a useful tool in ARCHICAD, which is Trim to Roof. So let's learn, practice, and share. Hello everyone and welcome back to my channel, Matt Tutorials. As I said, I want to draw walls for closing this area under the roof and on top of the last ceiling for this project. I would like to also do this for this side of the roof. And to start that, first I should draw some walls. So I go to the plan, I'm going to select the roof, then I'm going to click on the edge and then I'm going to select the offset and I'm going to put in 0.2 which is 20 centimeter to the inside. This is the slab that I'm draw for the ceiling of the last floor which is uh, the floor of the roof plan. Then I'm going to uh, select the wall tool and I'm going to put it on the chained method. Then I'm going to start from one point and draw the wall around the roof. And also I'm going to set the thickness of this wall to 20 centimeter, which is uh, the same as uh, the offset that we did. Then I'm going to select this wall that I just draw. As you see, it is grouped together. So with Ctrl Shift G, I'm going to ungroup them and I'm going to set the um, wall height to a one meter. So I'm going to take a look in 3D view. And we have something like this for around the roof. I'm going to select these three wall on this side. Then I'm going to click on one of these nodes and I'm going to stretch the height to the height of the roof. Then I go back to the plan. I'm going to select uh, the roof and then I'm going to offset only the gable on uh, this uh, roof like this. And also this one to here. Okay, I'm going back to the 3D view. Uh, the wall is selected and we see that this roof has a conflict with this wall. So I'm going to select the trim elements to roof. I'm going to select the roof that I want these walls to be cut with. And here we can select that we want this part of the wall or this part of the wall. As you see, uh, when I move between these two, ARCHICAD will show the remaining part with a blue line. So I'm going to uh, select the lower part and we have the walls that have been uh, cut by this roof. Another thing that I want to mention is this wall is existing to this height. But because we did the trim, we cannot see the upper part of the wall. So I'm going to select the roof and on the surfaces, I'm going to set the edge of the roof to the material or to the color that the walls have. So it's like titanium white. And as you see, we have a very neat cut of the walls and also we have a very clear model. Then I would like to make a challenge for myself. I would like to continue this wall with this height to this point. And after this point, uh, I would like this wall to be continued to the ridge of the roof. So I'm going back to the plan view. I'm going to stretch this wall a little bit back to something like here. Then I'm going to select this wall and I'm going to draw another wall till here. I'm going back to the 3D view and as you see this trimmed wall now stretched to this point and this is the new wall that uh, I just drew. So I'm selecting the uh, top node of uh, this wall. Then I'm going to uh, select the stretched length and when I hit the edge of the roof, as you see, the cursor is changed to an X symbol. So I'm going to click once here, 
then I'm going to select this wall and stretch it to the same point. It is almost done, but we still have conflicts with this groove to the wall. So I'm going back to the plan view. Then I'm going to select the roof. I'm going to turn off the cover fields for now. Then I'm going to select uh, this edge and I'm going to create a node right here. And then I'm going to select this edge and then I'm going to offset this only this edge and not this one uh, to this part. Now, if I go back to the 3D view, uh, we see that this conflict has been solved. And this is the roof that I did for uh, this corner. I'm going to do the same on this side. So you can uh, pay attention to the step that I make. I'm going to the plan. First, I'm going to stretch the trimmed wall. Then I'm going to draw another wall, which is shorter than this, like that to this point. OK. Then to the 3D view, I'm going to select this wall and I'm going to select this top node. And then I'm going to stretch this node to the edge of the roof. I'm going to stretch the length of uh, the trimmed wall. And on the plan, I'm going to select the roof, add a node to the edge of the roof exactly at this point that these wall meet like that. And then I'm going to offset only this edge to this line. Now I can turn on the cover fill. And if I go to the uh, 3D view, I'm going to have a very neat cut for this wall, this wall, and this roof. So I'm going to do the same for uh, this side of the roof, which is one of the main facade of the building. And that's how we can have a very nice and clean cutting of the wall with the roof by using a very useful tool in ArchiCAD trim elements to the roof or shell. And this is it for this tutorial. So if you like this tutorial, if you learned something from this tutorial, don't forget to hit the like button. And if this is the first time that you are watching my tutorial, don't forget to subscribe to my channel because there will be many more uh, exciting tutorials in ArchiCAD and other applications uh, that benefits the architects. In addition, if you have some problems working with this tool in ArchiCAD or you have some problem drawing something like this on your projects, write it down on the comments. I'm going to read all of your questions and I'm going to answer them all immediately. So have a nice day, everyone. Bye bye.